Uh, hey guys, welcome. This is Gaming Glow Cloud to a faceless let's play of Diplomacy, the game of international intrigue. Uh, okay. <coughs> I tried to turn the volume as low as possible. <coughs> I'm a bit sick right now, obviously, so I don't know. Anyway, let's get into this game. This game should be fun. I'm really excited about playing it. And yeah, it's going to be great. So we have seven choices of countries. This is Austria-Hungary. England, obviously. France, obviously. Um, Germany, Italy, Russia, and then Turkey. Um, since I'm Russian... I'm gonna start playing as Russia. Never played as Russia before. And I think I have actually. I think I played one game with Russia. And then one game with Austria Hungary. Yeah, I played one game with Russia and Austria Hungary. I thought I'd play this Turkey instead. <clears throat> I believe I played one game with as England as well. They were all at normal difficulty. So I wanted to try a game at hard difficulty. Started playing one at hard difficulty as Austria Hungary. But then I thought, why not? Let's play as Russia. Excuse me. So, yeah, let's get started. It's gonna be fun. Uh, it's different maps. There's only two choices. There are only two choices. Okay, let's get started. Started the standard scenario. Starts in spring 1901, and yeah, I don't know how many more maps are here. Okay, so you can load. So let me show you how to actually play this game. What what happens is you move your piece to a different territory, and these spots with the stars on them, you're, you have to capture them in order to win. You have to capture 18 of these to win a game. <clears throat> Each during the first few turn, turns it's not as um, power grab based yet. It's mostly um, moving around uh, grabbing well Turkey, Austria, Hungary and Russia typically I battle over the Black Sea and the, the Baltics that's the main goal right here for one of these typically it's between Austria Hungary and Turkey Austria Hungary being right here and Turkey being right there as you can see Austria Hungary is kind of blocked off by everything and like it's got Turkey to this side Russia to this side Germany to that side it's completely surrounded which is sometimes really bad for Turkey and Turkey is the uh, one in the game that's hardest to play as, which is why I tried playing as Austria-Hungary. Uh, not Turkey. Austria-Hungary is surrounded, and it's harder, harder to play with because it's surrounded by people. And so I, that's why I tried playing as Austria-Hungary. I haven't played as Turkey yet, apparently. <clears throat> yeah, I don't remember playing as Turkey. Anyway, the first move instantly, I'm gonna go with Black Sea because as you can see there's an anchor in Ankara and if he's smart he's gonna go Black Sea as well so yeah I'm not letting him have the chance I'm not gonna move Warsaw yet I'm not sure I wanna see what everyone else is gonna do I'm guessing cause this can move to Silesia or Prussia and then one of these can move to Galicia. But maybe if I Warsaw to Galicia, I can bounce that. That can F off. So yeah, let's see how that goes. As you can see, England is over here being England. If England and France team up, they sweep this, in this entire half right here. Like all of this is going to be pretty much gone. Typically, France goes for Spain and Portugal first, but I mean, I'm gonna. I'm not focusing on Spain and I mean on France or 
England yet because I haven't made any moves yet. So I've made my choices. Let's get it on with the moves. Let's not not get it on with the moves. See, he moved to Galicia. I was right. Ha! He's an idiot. <coughs> I predict that pretty well, actually. Moved to Silesia and Galicia. Yep. I play this uh, game on a regular basis with some of my friends, so I'm used to how they think, and so it's basically a compute uh, the same thing except for like now I'm dealing with a computer. Oh crap! This computer is smart. I see what he did there. I see what he did there. He's not going to give me the Black Sea, though, so that's still guaranteed. Okay, I'm going to get one piece. Two pieces if that works out, actually. Wait, but do I want to do that? Yes, I want to do that, because he's got a piece on me. I have to do that, because I want to gain two pieces, and then... But then I won't get, gain a piece at Sevastopol. I have to put it down Moscow, St. Petersburg. Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll just do that. <clears throat> I gain pieces this turn. Every two turns I gain pieces, and the pieces are based on how many supply centers I have. So right now, as you will see, I have like a little Russian flag. It's not Russian flag. It's the old flag before, you know, Soviet Union and everything. And um, I've got four supply centers right now. Yeah, I know my Russian history because I happen to be Russian. I don't know if you guys know that. Anyway, let's get on with it. Um, Italy is obviously going for Tunis this turn. Spain has been captured by France. Typical French move. I'm surprised this didn't go... Oh, something fell over here. I'm surprised this didn't go there. Typically... That's the, sometimes the, well, that's what I would have done. I would have gone straight for Triest, even if I didn't get it. Unless they worked something out. You don't know. They're going for Greece. And I think Bulgaria is going for Romania. And Serbia is going for Romania. So that's going to be a bounce. And, but I have support. How support works is one piece, well, obviously, one piece goes in and this piece supports it. So... It can't possibly bounce unless these two also support it. one. Like for example, if Romania moves in with the support of Serbia, which is not going to happen because it's Turkey v Austria Hungary. It's like everyone fends for themselves, sort of thing. And Germany is not being smart. Okay, let me see. Typical Germany move. Germany has Munich, Kiel, and Berlin. Um, there is a fleet in Kiel. Why they would move that to Holland, I have no idea. You can honestly... Like, your first move as Germany should be to go for Denmark. So, I mean, but I'm, I'm not dealing with that yet. And luckily, Norwegian Sea can't touch me before I... Go do anything with building pieces and stuff. So let's do this. Oh, Warsaw. I didn't move Warsaw. Um. Yeah, I think I'll hold there. Actually. Yeah, I'll, I'll hold it. Because that, that has a piece on me now. If he decides to go Budapest, then I'm screwed. <coughs> yeah. That would have been bad. Ooh, convoy. And here come the grunts. Ah, let me... Oh! That's nice of... That's really nice of them. They have the Black Sea now. But, hey! 
I captured some stuff. Oh, I should have worked with Austria-Hungary. If I knew they were going to go for Bulgaria, I would have stayed out of Romania. I would have bounced out of the Black Sea. Oh, well, I gained two pieces, so that's my advantage there. It's already been recording for ten minutes. Wow. Excuse me. They make really weird grunt grunting sounds, and it's really unsettling. Okay, I want to build a navy at the north coast. So, the St. Petersburg north coast. So, the next turn, I can go straight for Norway. Unless I go Denmark. I can't. I can't hold that. I can't hold Denmark. Not yet, anyway. Um. Oh, he bounced back out of Munich. Okay. Um, army in Moscow. And. Oh! Italy went straight for Triest. See, there you go. A bit late, but okay. I mean, they can. They're not going to be able to hold it this turn. I'm really concerned about this turkey being all up in my face, though. <coughs> Excuse me, sorry. <clears throat> Slightly dying over here. But don't, no worries. Right now I have the biggest peace gain, because somehow I gain both um, Romania and Sweden. Because the computer is working again... Uh, not working together, so if they were, it was if it was all against me, I would be pretty screwed. But I'm fine. Okay, it's my next turn, and uh, Turkey still has the Black Sea. Um. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna try. To get into Norway's butt. St. Petersburg North Coast to Norway. And let's support that St. Petersburg to Norway move. Yeah, we just want that one tiny little piece of Norway. We don't want the entire Norway. <coughs> um, now that he's got two on Sevastopol, I'm just going to hold Sevastopol. And support his hold with Moscow. Now, actually, that is quite concerning. I'm gonna move the Moscow to Ukraine instead and support Sevastopol's hold that way. Um. I don't want to move anywhere. I'm going to hold at Warsaw because I have a bad feeling about that. Although I hope that they they go back for their homeland and take back trees. I hope they wouldn't be that dumb to go after uh, Romania when they're being invaded by Italy. Who spawned a fleet in Venice? Why would you spawn a fleet in Venice? Like that... That's dumb. I guess... Oh, did they... But, no. He didn't move Rome at all. Okay. Yeah, we're fine. <gasps> moved out of Norway! <laughs> yes! That is everything I've wanted and more. That is everything I wanted and more. Wait. He supported... Oh, that butt. He's, Turkey and Austria-Hungary are working together. Oh, that cut support, too. So I lost the Black Sea. I lost Sevastopol. I mean... Um... Wow. I did not expect Austria-Hungary and Turkey. Okay, I retreat two pieces. 
Like, I have to disband this. Like, this is gone. And that has to go to Galicia. Man, this isn't looking good for me. Shit. Sorry for the cussing, but... Ah. I don't like that. Well, good thing is I can make my move on Germany, but... No, I want to... I can go at them directly. Ugh. Man. My goal right now is to kill off Turkey. Um, but for now, I'm going to hold Norway. Support, support that hold. So that I gain yet another piece at Moscow. And, um... Out of desperation, actually no, I'm in Galicia. Let's take advantage of that and move to Vienna. No, not Bohemia. Galicia to Vienna. Um, the good thing about that being there is I, it, that can't move. So, can't maneuver. He's going to gain that, but... He can't maneuver. That's good. Um, Ukraine to Romania. Since I don't have an ally in Germany, really, I'm going to go for Prussia. And Prussia's. I mean, and. But why? Okay, Warsaw to Prussia. And they still haven't taken Denmark. Which is, I think, what. The goal of this is maybe I should go to Sweden to Denmark. No, they're gonna uh, just in case. I don't want to get any more pieces disbanded. I want to at least balance out because one, two, three, four, five. S that would be six. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, yeah, I would still gain a piece. I stand to. Gain a piece. I have six supply centers. Okay, let's see how this works. Oh, betrayal! Interesting. That's interesting. <coughs> it's very interesting. Did not see that coming. I mean, why are you grunting all of a sudden? As if you didn't see that. Wow. So they totally all just like betrayed each other completely. That worked out very well in my favor. Like, I did not expect that. That was unexpected. I actually gained two pieces this turn. And they gained Denmark. But that's, that's fixable. Because they're all up in mainland France right now for some reason. They de Germany decided to invade France. There's no way that they're getting... Oh, they're gaining a piece. And there's a there was a bounce there. Okay. Um, I still gain two. Um, you know what? I'm going to go for that army in Moscow. And just to support myself in Warsaw... Do I want to give myself an army in Warsaw, or do I want to support all of that? Yeah, I'll give myself an army in Warsaw, because the armies can still go to Denmark. Um, <clears throat> yeah, and this way I can maneuver and get kick Sevastopol, take back Sevastopol, because my house is right there. I live right there-ish. Of course, this is 1902 right now, but yeah... Yeah. Okay. This has been going on for 20 minutes. Um, I'm going to go through this build step and I'm going to end this video here. So, yeah. Uh, let's hit play. Let's resolve. Let's see what happens. Let's see who builds where. England. 
Uh, Jer okay, I can maybe able to take Berlin. Okay, I have Warsaw, Moscow, Ukraine. This is perfect, actually. I still kept. I kept it. That's why I kept Romania, technically, because everyone was just like, "Nope, let's get the hell out of here." I mean, that's typical Romania behavior. What do you want, Italy? You want Trieste? Do I want to give you Trieste? Because I want, kind of want to get greedy and go for Budapest. Because Austria-Hungary's got two. I mean... Do I want to give you Trieste? I don't... No, I, 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 I don't... I don't trust Austria Hungary. I don't trust Italy. I just don't trust Italy right now. I don't know. That's kind of okay. I need to stop talking to you. Um, let's go Budapest and let's kick these buttholes out. Um. Warsaw to Silesia. No, not Prussia. Warsaw to Silesia. And just in case, we'll Prussia to Berlin. No, I don't wanna. I don't wanna deal with you. You suck. Actually, let me. He hasn't got a thing on Norway. Do I trust that? I mean, next turn I can always go back. Okay, so... I may stand to gain... Denmark. If I can get Denmark. If I can get Denmark this turn. Um... Okay, um, I'll play through this one more uh, one more step, and then I'll save and see you guys in the next video, I guess. But this has been really fun. This is, like, seriously my favorite game ever. Yeah, that's right. Throw that thing away. Oh, he suggested it again. He really wants to get into Triest. <coughs> he can get into Triest on his own. Actually, he can take Bulgaria. Yeah. He can take Bulgaria. Actually, they're probably going... Let's go. Austria-Hungary hasn't made moves. Italy hasn't made moves. Italy and Austria-Hungary. What are you doing? Okay, there we go. Oh, wait. Is that supported? Oh, he supported that. That's interesting. <coughs> so much grunts. This game is really unsettling with its grunts. Wait, so you're not gonna defend Berlin at all? I expected at least, like, some sort of challenge? <gasps> I gained Denmark! What the... F Why is this all working? How is this all working? That's the most important question. How? How am I... What? I did not expect this. Did not expect to gain Denmark on this turn. Expected to go Skagerrak and then gain Denmark with support. Man, this game is so much fun. Except for when you're playing against the computer, because they don't respond the way... You... Like, if these were my friends playing with me, like, they'd get so angry, they would. there would be board flipping. May lose Romania, but at least I gained... Sevastopol back. He's got another fleet on me. He's got like three on me. I'm kind of unsettled by that. Kind of. Ooh, he went Budapest. That's a bounce, yeah. Bounce, chica, bounce, bounce. Okay, a retreat step. Ooh. He can't. Oh, he gets disbanded! Yay! Uh, okay, let's watch this play out. Okay, that's it. Um, 
That's it for this turn. Uh, he disbanded that piece. So that worked. Um, he's got still got three on me, but he's gonna want to deal with all of that right now. I hope, unless he's fo still focusing on me, which is probably what's gonna happen. What? Oh no! That that moved to Skagarok. That moved to Skagarok. That's why. Okay. So yeah, I will save the game right now, and I will. Okay, yeah, there is a Russia one. I'm just gonna save it over, overwrite it there. All right, guys, thank you all so much for watching, and man, I I really enjoy playing this game. This this is gonna be great. This is what with the let's play that I was talking about. Let's play diplomacy. <clears throat> if you guys want to request other that other countries that I play once I'm done with this one like I can totally do that like I'm I'd be glad to if if you enjoy me playing diplomacy like heck yeah I'd play other countries especially if you want me to play as Austria Hungary because Austria Hungary is really hard as boss to play so yeah I'm doing pretty well as Russia now but that's because I'm Russian I have to be good at holding my own country so yeah, um, it's been 26 minutes, um, that's just about enough listening to me speak un unstoppably, I guess, for now, until next time, which is going to probably be like four, another 40 minute thing like Goat Simulator was. Alright, bye everybody. Uh, should I should you guys call me something like or like yourselves the fandom ish the 16 people that subscribe to me which is amazing by the way anyway no that's for another topic to, uh, to talk about another time um okay thank you guys for watching I will see you guys later and in the next video I'm okay never mind I'm not that smart suppliers thing um like, subscribe, do stuff. Do 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 do. Goodbye. No, that's also co technically kind of copyrighted. No, just bye. Get out of here. That there's no originality here. Eh, uh, bye. Okay. Eh. Uh.